Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm Chelsea if you're new and welcome back to another vlog. I'm actually getting ready to leave out to go get my nails done. Today is Thursday and I'm going to Cancun on Monday. I'm very excited because this trip for me is just going to be like a, just like a relaxing reset. Y'all know I've been moving, trying to get settled, just trying to do a whole bunch of things. So I just needed to book a trip to a place that I love so I can just relax. I am, however, staying at a new resort and I'm kind of nervous about it and also kind of excited about it. So, homegirl here, Sade, her birthday is during the time I'll be in Cancun. She's going to Cancun too. So, she sent me the hotel she was staying at. I had already booked the one that we were going to stay at, which is the Hyatt Ziva. If you're looking for an all-inclusive in Cancun, I highly recommend the Hyatt Ziva. I've been there like three or four times and I love it every single time. This time we're staying somewhere different. So, I'm excited, kind of nervous because I know I like what I like and I just hope that, you know, it's good. But I think it's going to be good. Anyways, yeah, I need to get my nails done because when I got my hair done, I got this hair jet black and it just totally ruined my nails i need a feeling anyway so i'm not that mad but yeah we gotta go get these nails done so that is first on the list get our nails done and then y'all know i like to get my eyebrows threaded well i don't like to get it threaded because it hurts but <laughs> i'm getting my eyebrows threaded because although my eyebrows are scarce when i get them like maintenance it actually looks like something so we're doing that and whatever else. Y'all know y'all coming with me. Y'all know y'all coming with me, so don't even worry about it. Car. I'm gonna try to get some footage at the nail salon. Hopefully I don't chicken out. Cause I started going to a new nail salon too, y'all. I went when I got a feeling for these nails. So this is gonna be my second time going back. Yeah, I will see y'all there. And these are the before nails. As you can see, they're like brown. This is how my nails came out, y'all. Um, I went more pinker than usual, and the white tip is a little thicker. Um, but it's okay. Y'all, I'm kind of like stuck in here at the works because it is pouring down, raining outside, like cats and dogs. Cats and dogs. But like I showed y'all, my nails are okay. I went pink because the pink didn't look so pink at first until she did three layers. This is bubble bath, OPI's bubble bath. So maybe if I do do this again, maybe I'll just get like one layer because three is just way too pink. I made it to my car, y'all. It's pouring down right now. I'm going home. Girl, made it back home. I look a mess. Like, my hair got soaking wet. It's just a mess. I had my package sitting outside. It's soaking wet. Everything just a mess. Everything is all bad. Let me show y'all what I got from Sephora. I know, oh, this package is so nasty. I know I be on TikTok. I've been seeing the girls make a sleepy time cocktail. And I was like, I want some of that. I want to try that. I want to see what that be about. One of the key ingredients that a lot of everybody's using. One of the key ingredients that everybody's using is magnesium. So I was looking for a good magnesium and I ran across a video and this girl, she said, I forget what this brand is called, Moon Juice. And they sold it at Sephora, so I ordered it on Sephora. And then I also have been trying to get my hands on this. This is the YSL Candy Glaze in the color 2. I'm about to try this out. I've been wanting this. Chrissy had this when we went on vacation. And I was obsessed. It feels so good on the lips. Mm. I love the way it feels. Packaging is so pretty on it. And I love the way it feels on the lips. And here is the magnesium. This is what it looks like. 
I've never taken magnesium before I had magnesium, but I've heard all magnesium is not made the same. So you want to get like a good quality one. Looked up the reviews on this and did a little bit of research and it seems like this one is really good. Um, it's called Berry Magnesium. Berry Calm, Berry Calm Relaxation Sleep. It says, um, magnesium is essential for relaxation sleep function. One I want to try looks so good. Like I said, it was like a sleepy time cocktail. So you do like one tablespoon of this. You do um, cherry juice, like real cherry juice, not cherry cocktail, but like cherry juice. And then she would top it with like a, a sparkling water. And I want to try it out. So it stopped raining, but a little bit later I'm going to go out. I'm going to go to Target and get the um, ingredients and we're going to try it tonight. It is pouring down raining again. I'm about to get my night started early. I'm about to cook. Just bought some pasta and some pasta sauce and some ground beef. And I'm going to take me a shower and I'm going to just chill out on the couch tonight and just watch TV. Two things. Tomorrow, I just remember I have a facial at 2.30. So we got to do that. And also tomorrow, I have to wake up early because we got to go get our nails done. I can't do it. I, I, I can't do this. Mm -mm, I can't do it. I thought I could do it. Like, I knew I didn't like the pink, and I knew that the white was a little too thick, but I was just like, you know, it's okay. I can make it work. No, 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 no. And I'm not going to go in there like, hey, I don't like this. Can y'all fix this for free? I'm just going to be like, I'm just, I just want a color change, and I'll pay whatever it costs because... I cannot do this. Good morning, y'all. I am up and about to go get my nails redone because I just can't do it. It's another gloomy, rainy day. And it's just so annoying. One, because who wants to be out in this? And two, because Atlanta cannot handle rain. When it rains, it floods. Like, it's so bad. I was on, um, I follow ATL Scoop. And yesterday, it was just so many cars underwater. Like, it did rain. But I didn't know it was raining that hard for this to happen. Like, insane. And freaking insane. My head has been itching so bad. I think I have an allergy to, um braiding hair because ever since I was a little child like it's always been like that oh god I'm about to go get my nails redone just I guess this is called like a polish change I know you sick of me with these nails but oh well but these are the before nails so we're going for something a more neutral base and way thinner white so let's go my hands are so ashy they look old as hell Made it back to the house and I love my nails. This is this is how I like them. I like the base color to be like a neutral, the white to be thin. So I just finished with my facial. We did a consultation and then we also she also just did some different things. Like I got um some microdermabrasion done. A diff like two different type of mask, a cleanser. I basically just had to do a consultation and get that done before I can get micro needling done because that's what I want to get done. So my next appointment, we're gonna do micro needling, and I'm super excited about that because I feel like micro needling when I got it done at one time, it was really good for my skin. I love the way my skin looked after. So yeah, I look a mess. <laughs> I don't think I've seen y'all since yesterday when I got my facial. Oh my God. It's so hot. But we're about to head to Target. I want to just only... Hold on. Alright. I only want to pack a carry-on to travel with. It's just so much going on. But I only want to carry like a carry-on. So that I need, I need many size like things. So we're going to go to Target. Honestly, I don't need to go to Target. 
but I'm kind of bored and I want to go to Target. I want to pick up a couple like minis. So that's what we're going to do. When we get back, we're going to wash our makeup brushes because girl, they, they need to be washed. They need to be washed. I curled my hair, honey, we looking good. Mm-hmm. All right, y'all, I'm in Target. Let me show y'all what I got in the cart so far. I have this spray sunscreen. I usually get the black girl one, but that junk ran out so quick, so we're gonna try this one out, and this one is way cheaper. I've never tried Aquaphor in my life, but I'm gonna try this out. Um, I got a little baby hairspray and then body wash. We're about to do a very quick Target haul. I gotta clean my bathrooms before we leave. So I got some cleaner with bleach. And then I also got this Lysol one that's just like a crown. Huh? Yes. Or it's her birthday. Um, just some regular foaming cleaner with no bleach. I got some magic magic erase. Well girl, this the off brand. Why we do that by the off brand and still call it the real stuff? These are eraser pads. <laughs> And then I got a bunch of stuff. Oh, and then I got a duster because I told y'all things get so dusty around here. We just got a bunch of stuff for traveling. I needed a shower cap because I be wearing my bonnet and the back get wet. And it makes me so mad. Like that's an ick of mine. So I bought a shower cap. Like just some random stuff. I got the body wash. I got Dove Bar Soap, Tylenol, hand sanitizer, deodorant, lint brush, Listerine. Just a bunch of just stuff. Um, I'm pretty sure I didn't tell y'all this before, but this is what I like to clean my makeup brushes with. It gets so clean. When I first started using this, it used to be like 60 cent. <laughs> I think it's still, I, I, I don't think it's like more than $2, but it's just crazy how much it went up, but worth it because this lasts me a very long time. If you got sensitive skin, you may, it may be too strong for you. I don't know, but this works for me. Absolutely love it. Before I do anything, I got to find something to watch. I was watching Platinum D, but her video is about over. I clean all of these brushes. They're all clean and I clean three beauty blenders. So yeah, I'm gonna let those dry and then we're gonna pack tomorrow. Good morning, happy Sunday. We leave to go to Cancun tomorrow. So we got some last minute stuff to do. Not really. Um, at first I was thinking I was gonna do my feet myself, but honestly, uh, I don't feel like it. <laughs> I even went to Dollar Tree and got this little bucket child. This was I was gonna soak my feet in here, and then I already have like the everything to like scrub them and blah blah blah. But I'm just really not in the mood for that right now. Like I'm just really not in the mood for that. So I may run and get me a quick petty from somewhere, but we got a pack today. This trip for me is about. Resetting, relaxation, a little bit of turn up, and just just grounding myself back to where I want to be. I'm really just packing some chill clothes, some stuff I can wear on a resort, a couple swimsuits to get in the water with. Like, this is chill. This is a really chill trip for me. So, yeah, I'm not really bringing... No outfits to take pictures in because that's not my intentions. That's not what I'm going to do. It should be easy to pack. <laughs> With that being said, um, I was going to just pack a carry-on. But then I remember I want to bring the hookah. So I need to check that. <laughs> we'll probably start to pack. I really want to drink, y'all. I want to go to Dunkin' and get coffee. And it's like, I have so much coffee in this house. But I just want to go to Dunkin' and get a coffee. So we might just go to Dunkin' and get a coffee. Because I really want to go to Dunkin'. To get a coffee. That's what I'm thinking. I feel like I look so pretty. Me? Okay, so when do y'all feel the prettiest? 
For me, it's when I have my hair done like this. It's my favorite hairstyle in the world on me. When I first got this hair, I didn't know it was going to be so long. I thought it was going to be like right here, but I still love it. But side part sewing, skin popping, lip gloss, and a little lash, no makeup. I just feel so pretty. Like, this is how I like to look. Like, this is this this makes me so happy. I just feel so pretty. And do you feel the prettiest? Like, what makes you feel the absolute prettiest? I wanna know. Um, yeah, I'm gonna take Sebastian out. And then I think I'm gonna run and get me a coffee. Cause I just I just really want a coffee. I'm so confused. I pulled up to Dunkin'. I'm already mad because I don't have sweet cream cold foam. And the boy, he takes my car, give me my car back, and he like, I'm gonna have to make this sandwich. You're gonna be straight. And I'm like, huh? Thank you. He like, you're gonna be straight. I'm like, yeah. I'm like, what, what you mean? I'm confused. I don't even know if this is gonna be right, man. Look at Sebastian. Ooh. Ooh. He's strong. I be trying to, I'm being more intentional about taking Sebastian out the house because, like, he could ride with me to come to Duncan. You know? Like, why not? Why did I forget all about this bag? This is definitely coming on vacation. If you can't tell, the coffee has hit. Oh, I'm so glad. I looked over here. Let me get my charger. Cause girl, now that I be in my office, having to go up and down two flights of stairs be crazy. So I be trying to bring everything. I need to get multiple chargers. I just ain't ordered them yet. Go boo. So yeah, basically everything is right here. We got makeup tools right here. Body sunscreen, body oils, makeup. Black thing has makeup brushes. That's like um skincare and just miscellaneous. And then here's the clothes. We got some pajamas. I just need to put it in a suitcase. Y'all probably don't know what this is, but this is the remote to our fireplace. It has been missing since we basically moved here, and it was in my freaking suitcase. It was in a suitcase. I'm so excited. I'm gonna turn it on tonight because. <laughs> We've been looking for this, but I'm just packing. Girl, I just threw all my stuff in here. Nothing neat. Um, I'm just trying to check this bag, put everything in here. I don't want to have a check bag and a carry on, so I'm just gonna have this check bag. And then y'all know, um, this bag I carry every trip she comes. This Saint Laurent tote. Oh, y'all, I'm tired. I cannot. Ju I'm just. I can't wait to tomorrow to do nothing for the next four or five days. Like, just exist. I'm so ready. I am so ready. Oh my God. You ready, Dion? Yeah. yeah, I'm ready. Big doll status, Bill Hart. Let's go. We have to drop somebody off. Y'all, I'm dropping my boo off. Our friends are going to watch him, and I am nervous. Go. <sighs> I'm going to try not to be aggravated because when we boarded him, they sent like a picture every night. So I wonder if our friends send a picture every night. You have to tell me. I'm not, I'm scared to tell him. I'll tell him. No. He's not going to Sebastian. Sebastian. I'm going to miss you. This is bag. This is bag, y'all. Dion packed it, so I need to look through it. Make sure everything good. Man, what? Two bowls. Why you wrote his name on his food? What other dog? Where's the um the bags? The poop bags. Oh, I got the one. I'm gonna get the other one in the car. The other one in the car inside the pack. What about his cookie? Got these little grooming wipes just in case they want to wipe him off. No, he don't need to take this. Yeah, I'm gonna take that one. 
we just dropped Sebastian off and now we're at Jimmy's. We're about to get some ice cream. Alright y'all, back home. I am about to do that curler thing to my hair. So my hair can look decent in the morning. This little situation. I'm hyper. <laughs> Off that freaking ice cream. I'm hyper. Sometimes when I get hyper, I be like, you're a grown woman. Control yourself. Seriously, come on. Just gonna comb it out, and then we're gonna do the little rolly thing. I'm not an expert at it, but I, I can make it do what it do. You know what I mean? All right. First step: split the hair. Second step: put this on. A clip right there to hold it and then I like to start from here and just start wrapping hair tie or something and you tie it towards the bottom I'm gonna take it off in the morning with y'all too so we can see what you're working with what you working with Twenty. 
I usually just do it like that. Just giving candy girls. Y'all, I don't like the way the curls came out. They were too tight. So I tried to like push my hair back and I don't like that either. I'm just, cause my leave out looks so bad, y'all. Oh my God. I just don't know what to do. I just don't know what to do. I really, really don't. My edge control and stuff is put up. Whatever, it doesn't matter. I'm about to water Sam and yeah, call the Uber. All right, hold on, I want y'all to see his whole body. Okay. I like to put the water real close to the root. Hopefully it rains. See you later, Sam. I'll be back. We're about to go, so I'm going to end this vlog here. In the next vlog, you guys will see, will be a travel vlog. So, hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Definitely make sure you like, share, and subscribe if you are. Okay, that's good. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye. just got here to Cancun. I slept like the whole flight. I was so tired. Waiting to get off the plane. I'm excited to do absolutely nothing for the next four days. So, yeah. Tell the group how you had to be wheelchair. I had to catch a wheelchair before. That's <laughs> so embarrassing. Why that fuck? Just the beautiful black people. Woo! We got here yesterday. And y'all, yesterday was crazy. Um, walked around the resort. Turned up. I was a complete mess. My hair was a mess. I looked a mess. I was being dumped under the water. Just taking shot after shot. But today... It's a fresh new start. I've gotten ready. I look good. I feel good. I smell good. We're about to go chill at the beach and just smoke hookah. Uh, I'm going to bring my book because I'm reading this book that's so good. Like, so, so good. So, I'm going to bring my book. We're going to have the hookah. We're going to have the speaker. We're going to have some drinks. And we're just going to be vibing out. So, welcome to the vlog. I don't really know what's going to be going on, but I got y'all. So, Let's go. And I look good. I, I look good. Yeah. I'm just trying to make it clear that I'm ready. So if anybody waiting on me. Girl, tell them how long it took you to get ready. Two hours? I'm ready. Two hours? I'm ready. Two hours? I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. We had a bar. About to get a few shots before we get to the pool. I'm gonna get an Aperol Spritz and two Don Hill. An Aperol Spritz and then two Don Julio shots. Get two shots of Don Julio and an Aperol Spritz. And he wants. Don Julio White, Don Julio Reposado. Let's do Reposado. And he wants. Um, oh, yes, okay. he wants Jack and Coke. Jack and Coke? Okay, let's fix. So why did it end? You need a line? Yes, please. Okay. 
Hi, I'm Chelsea, and this is my first shot. Man. <laughs> Y'all, how pretty is this view? So pretty. It's kind of like a um, infinity pool. And it looks over to the beach. So pretty. We have a, um, a little swimmer in front of us. I don't even think y'all can see me. It, it was like, I think my boyfriend, like bargain with them was 20. Not bargain. I, I think it's like different areas that they got hoop over there and the main front lobby got hoop. I see, I yeah, see. Yeah, yeah. So we're trying to see, cause I'm like. Yeah. Even for like getting the cabanas and stuff, we just fucking bargain with them. It's hilarious, I've never seen it before. Wow, me neither, it's usually like a set price. Oh, they don't have that. Damn, wow. Even for like uh, massage, today we're like, okay, we're gonna get a massage, right? How much? And they're like 260 US per person. I'm like, oh, no way. And I'm like, the wow. what? Wow. We're from Canada, right? Yeah. So I'm like, uh, I can get, I can go to top of the line <laughs> spa in Canada. I yeah. 150 Canadian per person, right? Wow. And I'm like, are you fucking in fucking, I'm like, with the plan of vacation. I'm like, don't be fucking naive. I'm like, no. And then they're like, oh, we have a promotion. It's 105. Of course you do. An American niece, you could have it for the whole week. Right we was like, can we bring our own hookah? He was like, yeah, just give me a tip. But we just set it up ourselves. Oh, this your own hookah? Yeah. yeah. But did you buy the charcoal for them or no? No, we brought everything. everything. Yes. Down right now. I'm going to meet the girls from the lobby. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to send them right there. They also will go and see if we can get a better deal on the hookah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> We're just chilling, smoking hookah at the pool, talking to people. So this resort doesn't have like a swim up pool and y'all already know how I get down. I love me a good swim up pool. They don't have one, but it's cool. It's people that can come around and give us drinks when we need them. So no big deal. Um, but she just came up cause she asked about our hookah and she was saying like, just bargain everything, negotiate. They got the cabana for a whole day for fifty dollars, and it was like it was one hundred and five. So fifty dollars. Let me get y'all with the sun. It's us. I be geeking. I was high as fuck this weekend. So, I been losing faith in finding peace. But honestly, it sounds like a fair trade to me. We are just getting out of the water, y'all. We were talking to two couples for like an hour. One was an older couple from London. So they have the cutest accents ever. And they were just the cutest couple. Um, they were each other's like first girlfriend, first boyfriend. And they've been together for 40 years. So that's so cool. And then the other couple was a young couple like us. And they've been married for three days. They got married on Saturday. And yeah, they're here for their honeymoon. We're about to see if we can get some food because I'm hungry. I want to eat so bad. We got some pico and some different type of sauces. Got some guac and chips. Bunch of tacos. Y'all already know I want to give y'all a room tour just in case y'all would like to stay here. I want to show y'all. This is like what the hallways look like. And this is the room we're staying in, 1154. You have these like wristbands that get you in and out. Then when you walk in, looks like this. Here's the bed. This bed is hard, but it gets the job done. And it's just really a simple room. I'm usually not a first floor type of girl, but I've never had a swim up pool and I wanted to try it. So we got a swim up pool. Oh, and they put us right in front of the freaking kids water park, but it's cool. So this is our swim up pool. I wanted, I like this swim up pool because usually all of them are connected and although they're pretty close they're not connected so i really like that this fucking boy just locked me out 
Open the door. Grow. I didn't even see you go out there, babe. You lying. We got like a little couch area right here. Um, full body mirror right here. And then I'm gonna come in the bathroom. And then here's the bathroom. All of my stuff <laughs> everywhere. I really like the mirror. It's cool. And got another little mirror right here. Mm. I love when they separate the bathroom, the toilet. So toilet's right there. Shower is right here. And yeah, that's the room. Um, of course, TV. At the end of the trip, we'll go through my pros and cons, which I'm just me, so whatever. It doesn't really matter. But yeah, that's what it's giving. Y'all know when y'all open the door, it turn the air off, so keep the door shut. And I'm about to touch my makeup up and flat iron my hair because I have to take a picture um, for a brand and I being was supposed to do that. So while I'm here, I'm going to take this picture, touch my makeup up, fix my hair, and then after that, we're going to take a shower and just chill out. Y'all yeah, can barely see me. Hold on. We're going to this glow party that ends in 30 minutes. But we got nothing else to do. So, why not? I just put on this like striped red and white outfit. Peppermint. And I got. I know you fucking lying. I look like a peppermint. <laughs> Bye, y'all. This is the main lobby, y'all. It's really pretty in here. It's a lot going on tonight. And that's the bar. And the light straight ahead is the glow party, child. Glow party. All right, let's see what it's giving. Getting a pizza made. I got sausage. No, this is pepperoni. Pepperoni. That's him making it. And they got the wood fire. Like, how cool is that? I'm putting it in there. Here's the pizza. Uh, you can make a drink. Yes. And two waters. Okay, I'm gonna try it out, y'all. Hopefully it's good. All right. Mmm. It's good. Good morning. Let me open up these blinds. This hotel. Ooh. Mm, 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 mm. Oh. Uh. Let me fix myself. <laughs> okay. This hotel makes me want to get blackout curtains in my room. I slept so good. It was so dark in here. Mm, 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 mm. But one thing about the blackout curtains, I be sleep all day. All day. I look a mess. But I just woke up. I just ordered me some room service. Um, so I'm waiting for them to come. When they do come, I'm going to eat outside on our little balcony and just catch some sun. Let me. Oh. There we go. Good morning. <laughs> When I tell y'all it's hot, it is hot. It, how many degrees is it? Definitely gonna be in the pool today, chilling. Today is gonna be like a no makeup day. I'm just gonna be chilling. While I'm waiting on breakfast to come, I can't get myself together, wash my face. Um, I put these plaits in my hair. So maybe it can be a little wavy when I take them out because I don't want to put no heat on my hair or anything because I ain't doing nothing. I'm not going to do no makeup today. Today's going to be relaxation. That's what this trip was for. Dion went to go look um, for excursions because he think he want to do something. But I don't know how that's going. I haven't heard from him. I'm gonna, let me call him and see if he's going to do the jet skis. What are you doing? 
Did you get him? No, he never came yet. He didn't come yet? No. Oh, you want me to see you drinking a mimosa? Um, so did, did, are you going to do the jet skis or what? I mean, I want to do something to you. Speed bump to two people. That sounds dangerous. This Belief Aqua Balm Moisturizer, oops, has my skin feeling so good, y'all. It's so moisturizing. And this little one, I told y'all a few blogs back, I got it um, for 100 points with my Sephora points. I got two of them for traveling. And it's just so good. It, it really is. out to see if we got any kind of wave going on. See a little thing saying. Got a little thing to it. Room service is here. I'm coming. Food is here. Let me show y'all. Everything looks like. So we have eggs, um, a random tomato, hash brown, waffles, fruit, three mimosas, all for me, and bacon. Yeah, I thought I was gonna go do bingo, and bingo is for kids. So we probably just gonna go to the bar, maybe. I don't know. We gonna we we'll probably check it out to see like what it's giving. And if the vibe's not there, then we'll just go sit at the bar and drink up. I just got on this shirt. It's like one of my favorite shirts I got from H&M. And then these linen pants. I just know it's going to be so hot. Whoo! It's like hey, so hot. Look at the camera. My camera fogging up. Let me see your shirt. This is the kids club right here. This where's that? So they definitely got bingo, but it's kids bingo. And girl, they won't even let us in there because it's like where they watch people kids at, so. So we're gonna just go to the bar, have a few drinks, and then probably like get in the pool. All right, so, trying to get y'all right. I got an Aperol Spritz. I was drinking them yesterday and they were really good, but you know you want a resort, child. You gotta find that bartender that you like and you gotta stick to it because everybody makes drinks different, but I'm gonna try it out. That's it right now. Good. 
good. <laughs> then I have one shot and this one drink. No, you didn't. That's your third drink. Uh -uh. Bro, the mimosas count. Mimosas don't count. We're playing Uno, y'all, and Dion lost the first game, okay, and he though, had to take a it shot. Was a good game, it, was it was a good, a good game. game, but you lost. It was a good game. I got me another Aperol Spritz. <laughs> These are so good, y'all. Like, they actually make them so good here. And it's so pretty. So, yeah, let's see. Yeah, water. Boy, I'm a lady. But let's see who loses this game. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, I'm gonna start this game off right. Reverse that to me. Draw two. Boom. If you get a version drink, draw two. Boom. We can't double. You know we're not playing that. That's so cute. Okay, okay, okay. Yellow. Go. Blue. Can you put my card up? Uno, baby. Uno, baby. Uno, baby. Uno out, baby. Ah. <laughs> I won. Take that shot. Take that shot. I lost. So I'm gonna take my shot. Cheer. <laughs> but I got some chaser. Child, if you know, you know. This swimsuit comes on every vacation since I've gotten it. Because I'm not really a swimsuit girl. Once I find something that works, it works. I don't take swimsuit pictures, so it don't matter to me. I put my Dior scarf on because I tied my hair up the best I could so it wouldn't like get too wet. So I'm ready to go. We're about to go to the pool. Good morning, y'all. We are about to eat breakfast. Um, the waffles were so good yesterday, so we got them again. Eggs, fruit, champagne, and orange juice. Y'all, look at this. My time for it, bitter peach broke. All the liquid is gone. <sighs> so sad, so, so sad. This shit is so expensive. Good morning, y'all. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Happy Friday. I'm back home. I got to give y'all a whole rundown um, as far as like the resort and just the trip and everything. I like I got a ball spot right there. Oh, my God. Um, <laughs> yesterday's Airport Chronicles was a mess, y'all. I ended up getting randomly selected to be searched and it was just so annoying like it was so much going on between the airport and the airplane i was exhausted when i got home i was just like i want mcdonald's and i want to go to sleep so that's what i did this morning i'm about to get my lashes done because your girl got a flight to catch tonight oh that's the service over there yeah i got a flight to catch tonight so I got shit to do. So first thing is getting my lashes filled. I just washed my face so they look a little crazy. But yeah, I'm going to go get my lashes done. And I will catch y'all up once I'm back home. Lashes are done, y'all. Y'all already know. Kelsey did them at Blink Babes. I'm about to go in his hair store. I home because the Mexico... Um, <laughs> Best TSA comb. thing took my comb. They always take your shit. And I need a brush too. So we about to go get that. We at the Beauty Depot. Girl, I don't know where I'm at, but we just ate at that Popeyes. There's a city trance over here. It's a fucking piggly wiggly. I don't know where I'm at, but I'm about to go in. Back home. It is. Back home. It is. 
It's 1 31. We gotta be to the airport by like 9 30 wow. at the absolute latest. Nine to o'clock. Yeah, I need to lay down, but I also need to pack this stuff up real quick. So I'm about to try to pack a little bit. And I'm gonna show y'all. I'm gonna show y'all what I got from the hair store. Alright, very quick beauty supply haul. I got two packs of these one inch flexi rods. These are like thicker ones for a more wavier look, not such a tight curl. So I'm actually taking these. I'm actually going to take these with me. Yeah, I got a bunch of socks. First of all, I don't know if you could tell, but these are like the scrunch socks. These are like new with like gold glitter. So freaking pretty. A black pair. A regular nude pair. This pretty green color. A white pair. And a brown pair. Some hair ties. Got a comb because they took my comb yesterday. I got a razor comb. I got some shears because I be cutting my hair with anything. Girl. Got a little edge control and then some holding gel. And that is everything I got from the hair store, beauty supply, whatever you want to call it. Oh, I got this brush too because I've been needing this for my little edge. It's a hard brush. And then I got this neck thing because I don't know if y'all be seeing the girls when they do their leave out, especially the girlies like me with short leave out. They'll like put mousse on it and sit the net on top. I'm going to have to watch a few videos, but this is the only kind of net I could find. So hopefully this one works. But should they like sit it on top? I don't know what they other need to do. But I'm finna wash my leave out um, in a little bit. And I'ma style my hair up so I don't look too too crazy. But I'm gonna try to just take my carry on. It's heavy, I gotta empty this thing out. I'ma try to just take this carry on. But as far as Cancun, we had a great time as always. The resort wasn't the best in my opinion. Um, as far as like aesthetically, it was really pretty. It was a really pretty resort. It was just kind of boring. They didn't have a swim up bar. They didn't really have um, any like parties for adults going on at night. The beach, I don't know if I actually showed y'all the beach water, but the beach water was not blue. It was like green and dirty um but you could still get in but it just wasn't what i was used to you know like it was giving like florida water <laughs> and not miami jacksonville so yeah it was just i don't know i don't know i just i don't know i like what i like and another con for me was that it was so far off the road you got to drive at least 10 minutes to get to the actually the actual resort so i didn't like that because i like a resort to where you're surrounded by things so if you want to walk off the resort do different things walk back on the resort you're able to with that resort girl once you own there you own there unless you finna leave by car because who's walking but all in all we made the best of it. We had a great time. It was a clean resort. I really can appreciate that it was clean. It was beautiful. Um, the drinks were good too. Like I didn't, I don't have a, you know how sometimes you can go to a resort and the drinks are really just not it. Um, that one went like that. You could get some drinks made and they'll be good. Um, the Aperol Spritz was really good. I had a few pina coladas and then mostly shots cause y'all know me, but I'll leave it listed down below. It's very affordable when you're thinking about resorts as well because the one I usually stay at is the Hyatt Ziva and it was like double the price for the Hyatt Ziva. So that one is definitely cheaper but I guess I can see why because they don't have as much. So just depending on what you, oh and one thing I do want to add if you're traveling with like kids, your children, nieces, whoever. That is a good spot for families and kids. They have so many activities for like kids to do. They had a whole like kitty water park. Um, they have like a kid daycare where you could drop your kids off. Like 
they definitely have stuff for the kids so if you're going on vacation with your children that's a wonderful spot so consider that for me i ain't got no kids what a look at that. no i'm just playing but yeah all in all it was a pretty good experience um uh, girl i don't know if i even told y'all but i got randomly selected to be checked um at the cancun airport that was super annoying especially it was kind of annoying and embarrassing because like on the way back coming back from vacation my suitcases i just throw everything in there like ain't no organization nothing so having it to, having to open that up was just like super embarrassing and just to be searched like that because like come, what's going on <sighs> but all in all great trip and now going on another one and then after that I'm coming home because tomorrow is fall y'all tomorrow will be September 23rd which is the first day of fall and I'm not even going to be home like WTF but it's cool though so I'm about to unpack this suitcase and then pack it back up and um take me a, like a little hour nap and I'll see y'all when I see y'all I'm annoyed because I packed my carry-on suitcase. However, if I buy a pencil sharpener, it won't be able to fit. So, I'm just going to take my carry-on. I mean, I'm just going to check my bag. So, I'm going to take all this stuff out and be able to put um, put all this stuff in the check bag. And I'm just not going to take carry-on because I don't need all that stuff. Like, I'm trying to not be an overpacker, but it's so hard. Especially, like, when you don't know what you're doing. It's just like, what do I pack? What don't I pack? Do I do this? Do I do that? Blah, 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 blah. I just woke up from, from a nap. I feel really good. Um, I just washed my leave out. I'm about to do the technique. I've been seeing the girls doing TikTok with, like, the foam. This is some Design Essentials foam. This is such a bad angle, but I mean, who cares, honestly. Let's get our part all right. Let's put that down like this. It smells so good, I can tell you that. After we got it all laid down. I don't know what the net do, but they be putting the net on top. So I'm gonna put the net on top. Y'all, I'm about to end this vlog because lately I have not been able to end my vlogs properly. So I wanna say thank you so much for watching this vlog. Hope you guys enjoy. Um, make sure you stay tuned because I I have a good feeling about Houston. I have a good, good feeling. I think we're going to have a good time. We're going to turn up. So make sure you stay tuned. This is my first time catching a red eye. The last flight of the night. So I'll let y'all know how that goes as well in the Houston vlog. So I love you guys so much. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you are new here, please consider subscribing. I would love to have you a part of my family and I'll see you guys later. Bye.